At some point in our lives, pretty much everyone has dreamt of flying a fighter jet. Performance-wise, it really doesn't get much better than one of these incredible aircrafts, which could be why several sports car interiors are inspired by fighter jets. Ever since they first emerged after World War II, they have inspired and shocked the world, even giving rise to dreams of power, freedom and fun. Whether you're just an aviation fan or actually looking to purchase a used fighter jet, we've gathered information and prices as accurate as possible. In reality, it's harder to become a fighter pilot than a professional athlete. In all fairness, owning one of these planes means you'll still need the appropriate license, a storage hangar, jet fuel supply and dedicated mechanics but plenty of old-school fighter jets are available for purchase to civilians. And while not exactly cheap, especially when factoring in maintenance and fuel, it's possible to fly one of these awesome planes for a lot less money than you think. A brand new Ferrari A12 Superfast comes with a starting price of $367,000. And we have found jet fighters that can be purchased for less money and are way faster than any road going vehicle could ever dream of being. The F86 Sabre is without doubt one of the most influential and historically significant fighter jets the world has seen. For a mere $275,000 it's possible to become one of the owners of these historic planes in flight versi condition and achieve an impressive top speed of 650 miles per hour. For a while, the MiG-21 was the backbone jet fighter of the Eastern Bloc during the Cold War. The plane is actually a relatively simple fighter jet, but it does pack a serious supersonic punch those willing to restore a model that sat in a museum and is in need of some work can their hands on this plane for a shockingly cheap $40,000. Or it's possible to purchase one in flying condition for just $185,000. The MiG-15 was the F-86 Sabre's contemporary as well as its main enemy. This fighter jet was the Soviet Union's entry into the modern jet age. An Evolti MiG-15 can be picked up for just $85,000. This one even comes with a spare engine to help keep it going for a while. The F-104 Starfighter was the affectionately known as the Missile with a man in it. It also had some less flattering nicknames. The plane was a Cold War interceptor, capable of going twice the speed of sound. Since she retired, F-104s have occasionally come up for sale. Those who want an F-104 with a working engine and parts will need to hand over $325,000. T-38 Talons have been training new US Air Force pilots to fly fighter jets since 1961. While many do remain in active service, they are being phased out as they age, and restoration ready T-38s come up for sale occasionally. If you want your own, $250,000 can buy a 75% complete restoration project, or spend $800,000 and get one with everything included. The Lockheed F-80 Shooting Star was a revolutionary fighter jet, produced under license in Canada by Canadi Air. The Silver Star is a more refined two-seat version of that early jet, 
While its top speed and acceleration can't touch swapping fighters like the F-86 Sabre, for $210,000 you can own a piece of aviation history and a plane that will still be a thrill ride to fly. The Furlongnad was a British jet trainer designed and built in the 1950s. While they served faithfully training new pilots to fly fighter jets, they also gained prominence for being the Red Arrows display team's jet of choice up until 1979. Currently for sale, a Red Arrows livery gnat can be purchased for $125,000. Magister is a simple and lightweight vintage jet intended to train new fighter pilots. Similar to the Gnat as well, the Magister served double duty as the jet flown by its home nation's air display team, the Patrouille de France, offering some funky looks. You can buy your own Magister in the Patrouille de France livery for $79,900. With enough spare parts to hopefully get it flying again. A successful Soviet jet trainer, the L-39 Albatross, entered service in 1971 and also carried out ground attack roles. L-39s were built by thousands and plenty can be found for sale, both from Eastern Europe, surplus and from North America where they are one of the most popular ex-military jets for civilians to own. If you want to join the club, a flying condition Air 39 can be yours for $315,000. Thanks for watching everyone, hope to see you in the next video. So stay tuned by subscribing and turning the notification on.